Michael Guerrero. I've been cutting here now for six years. It's been a, a good ride. I've been enjoying it. This is my third shop. Uh, it's called Top Choice Barbershop. We're down here in Homestead. It's um, also where I got my license at. I went to beauty schools of America. That's where I learned most of my stuff. Also with, you know, other barbers such as Will and, you know, Rick and other people that I look up to. And, you know, it's been a nice journey. I'm, I'm really enjoying it and I'm really grasping all this nice, beautiful environment that we have going on in the barber world. Um, I'm trying to take it now to the next level. I came out with a YouTube channel and um, I want to let you guys know it's called Top Choice Barbers, which um, in the channel I'm going to be, you know, showcasing different barbers such as myself, you know, other barbers that I look up to, other motivational, motivational innovational barbers that we have out there in the industry. Um, I'm also going to throw out some clotheslines out there, you know, so so you guys can get shirts such as this one to just cut it. Um, we've been active now for uh, six years and still on the go. Now I've been learning more about, you know, how to expose, you know, our work and, you know, how to how to bring it out to the light so everybody that's not a barber could understand what we got going on. Can you give any up and coming barbers advice on how to build up their clientele and yes. you know increase their income other than just cutting also other than just cutting behind the chair. Definitely. One thing that you can do to increase your income is always going to work is flyers and business cards. You always want to reach out to people face to face, one on one, so they can understand that you're being real about your business and about your craft. You don't just want to, you know, tell people, oh I can do this, I can't do that, and then you don't show face. You have to show your face. You also have to Go out there to the social network and also expose yourself and let people know from the bottom and from the top that you got what it takes to give them a nice haircut. It's always going to be on you. It's a personal focus. It's a personal marketing. It's called self-motivation. You want to self-motivate. Once you self-motivate yourself, you're going to motivate others to believe in your craft. You're going to want to use, you know, like appointment um, strategies such as books, app, you know, you can use uh, jam books. You know, you can switch it up and try different uh, areas in marketing, such as Instagram, which is one of the biggest fields right now going on for the barbers. Um, you know, it's, it, there's a lot of things out there that you can use. You just need to go out there and look for it. Definitely, you want to advertise and, and market real, real hard. So, Mike, what do you like most about the barber industry? What I like about the barber industry the most is uh, my flexible hours and that I can take vacation basically whenever I want. It doesn't mean that I'm going to slack and just take off whenever I want to, but you do have a choice. You can make your time your time. You don't have to depend on, oh, if the manager's calling you because you have to be here at 9 o'clock or you have to be here at 10. I really enjoy that flexible time, especially, you know, I have three kids. I have two boys and a daughter. And, you know, I, they play basketball. I have my daughter in dance. and. You know, it takes a long time for you to take care of your kids, you know, you just can't be stuck somewhere all the time. And that's what I like about barbering. I like the flexibility and I love to cut hair. I mean, I love to talk to people. I get to meet new people every day. I get to meet hardworking people. I get to meet motivational people, people that inspire me to go to a whole different field. Um, you know, I'm doing barbering right now, but I'm also doing a airplane club in Dominican Republic, which you know, that helped me expand from here, from the base, which came from the barbershop, you know, talking to everybody and exposing myself to this world. The world has a lot of opportunities, um, especially the barber field. It's a, it's a great field where you make a lot of money, you know. People don't understand that, you know, you see cash day in and day out. And it's a good thing and a bad thing because you have to learn how to take care of your money every day because if not, you'll spend it. But if you're a smart person, you get your stuff together, you, you know, you organize yourself, barbering is perfect because it's very, very flexible. That's what I love about it. You know, from the beginning, that's, that's, that's the, what got me, you know? How did, how did you get into barbering? Um, I got into barbering about seven years ago. I, um, I was without a job. It was during the recession. I was running around like a chicken with his head cut off. I was looking for a job. Nobody wanted to hire me. You know, it was real, 2008, nobody, nobody had no jobs, no work, so one of my friends was a barber and he told me, Mike, man, why don't you come to the beauty schools of America? And 
I went and I checked it out. I started cutting hair. I saw that it was something very, you know, educating, very innovating. It was something that it was recession proof. And as I started cutting hair, man, I just liked it and liked it and liked it until I got my first shop. You know, I got my first shop in the flea market. I didn't start big. I started from the bottom. I got my first shop in the flea market. I worked there for about a year and then I built from there on. It's always marketing. Like I told you before, marketing is the key. Definitely. I tell everybody where they can find you at, all your social media outlets and your YouTube channel. All right. One of them is going to be, you can find me on the YouTube channel on the Top Choice Barbers. You can also find me on Instagram on the Top Choice Barber, which I'm exposing people, you know, that are Top Choice Barbers out there and, you know, doing real nice haircuts, which is the same principle as YouTube. You can also find me on, on Facebook on the Top Choice Barber Shop. And um, you can also hit me up on the email on the Top Choice Barbers at Yahoo.com. Um, I hope that was enough for you guys. Uh, anything else, you know, just reach me at the shop at 305 771 7053. We're located in Homestead, 32 Southeast, 4th Road. You already know, Homestead, Florida, baby, all day.